All right, before today's video gets started, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, turn on post notifications, drop a like, and if you want to keep up with me, make sure you guys go follow me on Twitter right here up on your screen. I post whenever I'm going to go live or whenever I'm going to upload a video. So make sure you go follow me on Twitter. Yeah, they selling lies and I bought it. Yeah. Don't tell me that you love me if you ain't going to die for me. You can stay the fuck around me if you ain't going to ride for me. Told me you would never leave. Why can you just lie to me, yeah? Get from off your knees, you ain't gotta cry to me, yeah. I been giving all my love Tell me, do you feel it? Never learn What's good YouTube, it's your boy Only One Almighty and I'm coming to you guys with another video now. I know you guys haven't heard my voice in a minute and I know I haven't uploaded in a little while but this is the perfect time for me to bring you guys a video and in today's video I'll be bringing you guys a new VC glitch after the latest patch of patch 8 you know what I'm saying or patch 108 as the PS4 calls it but anyway first thing first I want to give a shout out to my man Dan he was the first person that I saw this on I will leave his link in the description you guys want to go check him out but first thing you want gonna want to do is make a new player to start this glitch off make a new player just like the old glitch that they just patched recently patched when they did the um update make a new player now me personally I find it helpful that the post score the peer post scoring center always gets in the game which everybody if you guys are familiar with the first glitch you know you need to get into at least two of the two of the games in order for the glitch to actually work effectively and faster now like i said you want to make a peer post score at the center position and you do want to max you want to max his weight and max his wingspan out now i don't know if that's like principle but me personally i find it better that you just go ahead and just like max it out because i'm pretty sure the nba like in this day and era the nba nba teams like taller versatile players you know what i'm saying the period post score pretty damn versatile versatile in my opinion but anyways like i said you're going to want to max his height out you're going to want to max the weight out like i said again we're doing peer post scoring center and this glitch honestly this was my first try on this glitch right here. I honestly didn't know if it was going to work. If it worked, I was going to upload it. If it didn't, I was going to leave it alone. But, I mean, here we are. So, <laughs> apparently, it works, you guys. It works as of right now where I'm at. It is 3.16 a.m. You know what I'm saying? I'm bringing you guys a very, very early early upload man i appreciate you guys sticking around man. i know i wasn't having been consistent with my nba 2k19 um uploads this is the game is not it's not there but anyways like i said peer post score max weight max wingspan you guys want to make sure you hit yes when it says do you want to skip the prelude and go straight to the nba make sure you hit yes if you don't you're gonna have to start this whole you're gonna start have to make a new player but anyway you want to go since you're going to be a pure post guard, I'm pretty sure everybody's got the same options. So you want to go to the Cavs. For one, they don't have a damn center. Tristan Thompson is not center worthy. In, um, anyway, anyway, we're going to get off of him. Anyways, like I said, you want to go to the Cavs. And once you go here and negotiate your contract, you want to lower it down to like 640-ish. Take your minutes all the way down. Take your year down to one. Your one-time bonus needs to stay the same. Now, he's going to automatically jump on that right there because it's cheap and everything. Once you get right here in the my core, you see what I'm saying? Don't start your first game yet. You want to go to your settings, and you want to make sure that you set it to 12-minute quarters. Then you can go start your game right here. Now, this is the um important, important part of the glitch, kind of. You want to get subbed in within the first one to fourth game. The first and fourth game, you want to be subbed in. Now, me, I'm lucky enough that I got subbed in right here. Like I said, this should work nine times out of ten, eight times out of ten, that you guys get subbed in your first or your second game with this period post score dummy account. See, I don't get subbed in at, at um the first half, but in the second half, you're more than likely to get subbed in, especially if you're either blowing that team out or you're getting blown out. One of the two, you're going to be getting into the game. Now, you guys are going to see once you come in from halftime, I actually get subbed into the game. And we are up, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. But regardless, when you get subbed into the game and it's after halftime, in order to sim out with VC, you need to be up by you need to be up or down by at least 10 to 15 points. And you guys can see right here, I had a mistake. We were down. <laughs> but anyways, once you get subbed into the game, whenever you get subbed into the game and you're about to sim out. You want to make sure that you're simming out with VC 
and you want to make sure that you're either up by 10 to 15 or down by 10 to 15 you see we're getting crushed this is why you go to the Cavs they're gonna get crushed by more than half the teams in the NBA but anyway you see I hit um same with VC right here and we're gonna um, cut right out and we're gonna go they're gonna you're gonna get a after game interview with one of the reporters now once you get this interview as you guys are going to see right here, my player is going to go right down the tunnel. He's going to, on the way to the locker room, he's going to um, stop him. And once you get the interview, you want to make sure that you hit shout out to fans. I think that's what the option is. Shout out to fans or not as the fans. That's going to give you a boost to help out with the rest of the glitch. You know what I'm saying? That's another important key. You want to make sure the first the first key is to make sure that you, um <coughs> excuse me, Make sure that you guys do not go into the prelude games. You want to skip the prelude and go straight into the NBA. Then, then the second step is to make sure you get your contract done and you go to a sorry team that does not need your position. Thirdly, you want to make sure you acknowledge the fans. You see right here, you hit call out the fans right here, and he's going to do his little response. I honestly skipped it. Ain't nobody got time for that. But anyways, once you get here, you're gonna wanna sim all the way to April 1st. Now, some teams, depending on your um, archetype, are gonna have a different date. Just make sure it's like April 1st, April 2nd, something like that. But April 1st is the thing we're looking for. And I'm just gonna hit sim, and then I skip forward to like March 24th or something like that. So just for the sake of the video, don't be too long. It's already like 20, 20 something minutes long, you guys. You guys bear with me. Promise you this is gonna be worth it. Um, but anyway, you see right here, this is what you're looking for. You're gonna have that little ticker down at the bottom on your endorsements. That's gonna you're gonna click on that. You're gonna go to your national endorsements. You're gonna load up into the um, VC, the VC place, VC management office, whatever the, whatever they call it. But once you get there, she's gonna you can skip the little dialogue talk that they get into. She's gonna ask you guys what um. What, in, what first endorsement you want to go with do not I repeat do not do not do not pick Gatorade Gatorade does not offer the same amount of VC and I don't think the glitch works with Gatorade I don't know I'm just saying based on how I've seen the video the video that Dan did and I've seen other people's videos like I said shout out to Dan he's the first person I've seen this video on but as you see I'm walking into the office right here I'm gonna walk in she's gonna be like oh Oh, you're killing it, all this. Skip all that. You see she's asking which endorsement company you want to work with first. Hit Foot Locker, you know what I'm saying? That's just the way it is. And once you do that right there, he's going to walk out. And you're going to pull up the nav right here. You guys are going to see. And then you simply just want to play the next game. Now, this game right here, you don't have to play. If I'm not mistaken, I don't. you do not have to play this game right here. It would help if you get into the game, but you do not have to play this game. You will still be able to get your negotiating, um, your contract negotiation for your um, your for your first level, your first level on your Foot Locker contract. You will still be able to get it. But like I said, man, I hope you guys will bear with me throughout the video. I know it's a long video, but trust me, it is worth it, man. The last VC glitch, I know you guys was hitting on that. That last VC glitch even came in handy for your boy. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but I hope this video helps you guys out, man. If you guys need any help, don't hesitate to comment down. Don't hesitate to hit me up on Twitter. Don't hesitate to hit me my PSN. All of them will be in the description. My comments are open. My DMs are open on Twitter. You know what I'm saying? I will get back to you guys, and I will try to help as much as I can. Now you guys, you guys see him right here in the locker room, getting ready to head into the next game. I meant to fast forward this part. I totally forgot, but hey, bear with me. We in this together. You know what I'm saying? Anyways, like I was saying, man, if you guys have any questions, just hit me up on Twitter, hit me up on PSN, or comment down below. My Twitter, my PSN are all gonna be in the description. If you guys have any questions, concerns, or anything like that, just hit me up, and I will try to get back to you as fast as possible if I can help you out. But anyways, like I said, back to the glitch, man. Like I said, you guys do not need to get subbed into this game right here. It doesn't matter. You're still gonna get your contract negotiation. You see, I'm just I'm just fooling around with the 60 year old, just kidding around. But anyway, you're still gonna be able to get your contract, your contract negotiations. You know what I'm saying? So we we just gonna kick back, 
let this load in and that's what they're gonna and I'm gonna come back to you guys once this game is over with Alright, we're back, and you guys can see I did not get subbed into this game right here. They was not fucking with the kid. They did not put me into the game. But anyway, we're going to continue with the glitch. I'm sorry. I had to cut out because that jump was taking too long to um, load, and I forgot to cut it out. But anyways, like I said, they did not put me in. You do not have to get subbed into this game right here. But the next game we're going to play, you have to get subbed in within some point. If it doesn't sub you in, you can try the playoffs, but I think that would be kind of pushing it. You might want to start over, or you can try the playoffs. I mean, the playoffs work. I've heard the playoffs work, but me, I'm not trying to deal with that. Maybe you go, I don't know. But anyways, <laughs> we're in the locker room. You see you got the yellow tick by your name, by your um, endorsements again. And like I said, here's your um, full locker level one contract. And you see you just skip through all this right here till you get to the um, negotiations. Now, <clears throat> like I said, you skip through all this once you get to all the um to get to the details of the negotiation, and you want to just go ahead and put this to 2500 2500 VC per event, um, everything else zero, you know what I'm saying? Everything else zero, just like I got right here on the screen, and you hit them with the counter offer. They're gonna keep saying, uh, we don't think this is a good offer or anything like that, and uh, eventually they will accept you see he accepted that one pretty damn quick now me i went straight to the neighborhood because this is how i did the old method now i seen dan went straight into the next game um i'm guessing you can do that either way but me i just want to go ahead and get my level two contract negotiations out the way so i went on here and did that and once you do this right here once you get to this step right here you want to go all the way up to 5k vc now with dan's method um i didn't pay attention i'm doing it like this because this is the way i did the last one you guys can copy me or you can look at his video like i said i'm going to leave it in the description but back to this they're going to keep declining you saying this is not a good offer keep counter offering them with the 5k and everything of zero eventually they will accept it like they did here and from there, start your next game. Now, this game on one of these games, you have to get subbed in to the game. You have to get subbed in. Like I said, like I said earlier, earlier on, it's okay if you do not get subbed in right away. You could try your next game, your other game, your other game. Now, if it push into the playoffs, you may can get away with that. But if you're not up for it, you can create another player. Like I said, I've heard the playoffs work. The playoffs worked in the last one, so I'm pretty sure it will work in this one too. So, you guys can see right here, halftime, your boy. You do not, I, I honestly, it would not matter if you got subbed in at halftime. You want to get subbed in after halftime, I mean. You want to get subbed in in the second half of the game. So, you will have the, the um, ability to sub out. I said sub out <laughs> to sim out with VC. You know what I'm saying? You want to be able to get get out of there and get out now. If you do happen to get subbed in the first half before halftime, just foul, just foul until they take you out. You know what I'm saying? About two, maybe two or three fouls, they will take you out the rest of the half, and you will come back, and they will eventually put you back in. But like I said, simply, you see, I got got in here in the fourth quarter. Simply just wait them in by the ball, and I'm gonna simply just go up here, ask out, send with VC. Bam, simple. You see, we was getting our ass whooped. Like I said, but like I said before, you must either be up or down by 10 to 15 points to sim out with VC. You do not want to sim to simulate the game. You want to sim with VC. That is another point step. 
if I'm not mistaken. That is a very important step. I haven't seen, I don't know if that's an essential, but for me, I just like to keep things straightforward to make sure you guys know. Anyways, semi with the VC. And you guys are going to see right here. Once I, I believe I skipped all this. I'm not sure. You can just hit circle if you don't feel like watching this right here. What in your gameplay? You can just hit circle right here if you don't feel like watching. You guys can see how much VC I have right here. At the end of the video, I'm gonna show you guys um, a way to rinse and repeat. Cause I don't think I don't think in Dan's video he show you. I think he tell you. But I'm actually gonna show you guys, and I'm also gonna show you guys the amount of VC that I got at the end of the video with the VC that I had right there. Now, you guys can go right here. I just see I'm just checking to make sure I got the endorsements. Now, go to the neighborhood. You simply go to the neighborhood. Once you load up in the neighborhood, you can check it again. I mean, that's just me checking again. At this point right here, don't click it yet. You just want to close the app. Close the application. Go over to your settings. Find application. Save data management. Go to your save data and system storage. Once you go there, you want to, or another option. You can just hit upload, save data, and then it'll pop up on this screen. And you can do it from here. You can select the upload or select and download from there. But anyway, once you're in the settings, you're in that. You want to go to save data and um, system storage. And you want to upload to online stores. Now, once you get in there, you want to hit NBA 2K19. And you want to click on the player you just made. For me, I just made this one player. And you can also tell by the time that you made it. The time and date is on there. So that will help you help you guys know when you what player you are on. Don't mess up and delete a player or upload a player and overwrite something that you um that one of your main players or anything. Anyways, once you do that, load up 2K simply. And then from there you can just go ahead and do the same method. It is the same thing. It's just one simple step that you guys must do in order for this glitch to work for you can rinse and repeat to get your 15k instead of just getting a regular 5k if you do it this way and then you close app and you go directly in it's only gonna give you 5k so once you do that you click that endorsement and once the the um billboard pops up you hit circle it's gonna load a little bit you hit x and you close app immediately close app go over to your settings again application save data management again this time you're going to go to save data in online storage you see see why you saved it on online stores now from the system and then you want to download it back to the system and you just same thing you click the one that you just did and then you i mean you can apply to all or you don't have to apply to all it just depends if you're doing that first step you can apply to all so you can save all your players at one time so you don't have to um do them one by one anyways like I said, you can select. You don't have to select all on that one. It's just that when you first do it that first time, you want to select all so you can make sure if you have more than one player. Anyway, once you load in here, you want to do it again. Simply do it again. Hit it. Load up your endorsement. Hit it. Once this bill will pop up, hit circle. I don't know why the hell it's taking so long to load up. But once it, it takes about maybe rough 20, 30 seconds to load up. I don't know why. The old method used to just like that anyway once it does load up again you simply hit x close app simple close app go right back to your settings find your application save that management one thing i did not mention in the beginning of the video i'm so sorry you need playstation plus for the people who don't have playstation plus you can easily use a usb flash drive you know the ones you can easily plug in to where your um controller charger goes to or any, to your um usb ports on your ps4 you can easily use one of those now with that being said back to this right here you just do the same thing over again you save it you save it to the um system you upload it from the um online to your system storage and then you do it you want to do this three to four times so you do this again one more time right here Click the endorsement <coughs> excuse me click the endorsement once you click it your billboard pop up hit circle it's gonna take forever to load again about wait about 20 30 seconds and it should load up and once it loads up you hit X close out simple again settings application save data management Save that in online storage. Click on NBA 2K19. I mean, click on download to system stores first. <laughs> then you click on NBA 2K19. Find the player 
that you are working on currently, which would be this one right here for me. You could tell by the date and the time that I was doing it. And you just um, upload it. If it says overwrite, you hit yes. Simple. You load 2K up again. And it's going to take, it don't take that long to load into the park, but it takes a little long for that little message to pop up. I don't know why, man. But anyway, load into the park. I had to skip that for the sake of the video. Load into the park. And since this is our last time doing it, we're going to go ahead and accept the message and do not close app this time. We're not going to close the app and we're not going to do the um, application save data management part. So you just want to go ahead, hit the endorsement. Once the billboard pop up, hit circle. We're going to wait 20 to 30 seconds the message is gonna pop up your check is not available do not again do not close the app do not do application save data management and if you guys want to I mean it's not part of the glitch but hey an extra 1k VC is not gonna hurt anybody you can go ahead and click both of these a smaller endorsements you know what I'm saying and it's gonna do the same thing for these two so you have to wait another 20 to 30 seconds you know what I'm saying and once it does that you click on the other one it's gonna you see it's gonna say your check is available and then you do this other one hit circle <clears throat> you hit circle and then we're gonna see him and you're gonna wait another 20 to 30 and it's simply gonna it's gonna be done and then you guys can go co check collect your VC I'm sorry man it's it's early in the morning I really need to be to bed but I had to get this out for you guys I had to have upload in a while and this was a pretty good video to get you guys so you guys can be getting this VC you know what I'm saying but anyways now it's gonna say your check is available you simply hit X and you just, just wander on over there to the um VC management place you see you, you guys see this is exact same player I've been using the 60 overall 73 whack <laughs> wax max wingspan max weight pure post score this is the player I use play I recommend if you're gonna be creating a new player so you can do this glitch because you're gonna get in because most the Cavaliers go to the Cavaliers again like I said in the video because they do not have a valid center and you're gonna get minutes look and you guys going here she said got check for you all this BAM 15k and an extra 1k right here now I'm gonna show you guys how to rinse and repeat simple you do the same thing as we was doing with the glitch you BAM close your app <clears throat> close your app application save down in management in your settings save that in online storage download the system storage once you hit that NBA 2k19 click the um, player that you were just working on you can tell by the date and the time hit it and then apply you don't have to hit apply all and then I'm gonna show you guys that I'm loading back up you see I numbered it the whole time it was number one it's a 60 overall peer post score and it's gonna we're gonna wait until this until this loads up man one more time man shout out to my man Dan he was the first person that saw to upload the video on this glitch so shout out to you as you guys can see I have 146k now and I'm gonna go check my endorsements my endorsements are still here if you enjoyed the video hit that subscribe button hit that like button I'll catch you guys in the next one man peace <laughs>